Alrighty, everyone. So let's go ahead and spend some time to take a look at today's sponsor, and it is no other than Hackend.ai. Now, for those of you out there who care about cybersecurity as much as I do, as well as maintaining a simplified browsing experience, you'll definitely want to check out the Hacken platform. And I put it simple, Hacken is building a 360 all-in-one platform that not only teaches you the in-depth knowledge and proper practices of cybersecurity, but along with that as well, is able to provide a ton of tools such as its password management and darknet monitoring tools. And we'll dive into all of these tools and more as we take a look at the application in a couple of moments. But I want to go ahead and not only talk a little bit about the team's experience and the previous works, but along with that, talk about the key issue that Hacken is trying to solve. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a step back here. For many of you in the cryptocurrency space, the Hacken name will probably be a familiar one as the Hacken cybersecurity ecosystem has existed since as far back as 2017. And they've built a lot of interesting tools from exchange certification platforms to bug bounty program platforms. One of my favorite ones is Certified, and this is the one that actually goes through and manages different certification scores for user security and service security for all these different exchange platforms. It even keeps a tab on the overall cold wallet reserves in this case for these exchanges. Plus, their hacker-proof platform. This is where people can submit bug bounty programs to find exploiter bugs in previous applications or projects. So again, really interesting tools, just part of the, a part of the suite of tools that they've come up with on the Hacken platform. And this comes from a team that has over 50 years of combined experience in cybersecurity. But all of this is really interesting, guys, and I want to talk a little bit more specifically about something that's probably one of the biggest issues that doesn't get talked about and we just tend to live with in today's world, and that's improper password management. This has been one of the biggest issues that techies have been trying to solve for the last couple of years, which is making sure that we can have a safe, secure experience where you're not going to have your password put you in a position where you could be exploited, where someone could easily guess that password and get access to either vital information or worse off your financial uh, activities, in this case, being able to manage your money and possibly steal your funds, right? So we can take a look here, and one thing that actually shocked me here, this is something that I learned as I was going through and setting the Hacken platform, is that over 76% of people who are in the age group of 18 to 24 tend to reuse passwords, and it's actually the highest bracket out of any age group. But you can generally see here that this is a problem across all age demographics and all people across the world, that we tend to reuse passwords, and we tend to have a lot of flaws when we generate passwords. We tend to generate very simplified passwords that would either be put into a category of weak or very weak. And this is doing things, for example, like having one, two, three in our passwords, uh, using our names in our passwords, and most importantly, rep uh, uh, rep repetition of those passwords in this case. That's usually what leads to mass security vulnerabilities for a lot of people. So we're going to be diving into the platform here, taking a look at the application, and we can not only see that the user experience here for the app is very clean, but it comes jam-packed with a ton of features that we're going to be diving into. The Cyber Bootcamp is probably the clearest and coolest function, in my opinion. Teaching cybersecurity is probably one of the most complex aspects of making sure that people know how to take the proper steps and procedures. And we'll see that they have a very clear module system that makes learning about it a lot of fun and very engaging comparative to just just having simple notes or simple educational points. Along with that as well, the Darknet monitoring tool. So to put it simple, the Darknet monitoring tool is actually going to allow you to be able to scan to see whether or not your information has been compromised on the dark web so that someone else might have your information. You can at least spot it and change your password so someone wouldn't be able to access your account. And also the password manager tool. This is probably the biggest point here. Many of you have probably heard of a lot of different platforms like Dashlane, things of the likes, and those are all great platforms. But the cool thing that Hacken is gonna provide again is that all-in-one experience where they can service as your password manager, even on mobile in this case. And we'll talk a little bit about that as we dive through the app, as well as their digital wallet in this case that allows you to store a decent range of cryptocurrencies. Now they've got a whole suite of tools here, and I wanna really drill this in before we dive into the app, that they've got things like multi-factor authentication, secure storage, and VPN technology, that they're going to be offering in the application as time progresses. It is in beta right now, guys. So again, toy around with it, test it out. It's available on iOS and Android, as we'll emphasize towards the end of the video. And we'll have a link down below in the description to find out more information. But let's go ahead and actually dive into the Hacken app. 
Alrighty, so now that we're actually inside the Hacken app, the first thing you'll probably notice is that the user experience is extremely clean. Again, I always look for a clean user experience on mobile applications. And you can see here that we're taking a look at the dashboard. This is kind of your central hub for all things in relation to your account. You can see a score here for your security health status. You can get jumped right into the education. And you'll also see that you have different achievements as well as collectibles tied to your high character in this case that's the major kind of icon for the Hacken app in this case the little persona here and again we'll be able to see how we'll be able to collect some NFTs for our character as we go throughout the modules. And speaking about the modules I think this is probably the best feature for those of you out there who are going to download the Hacken app and that is the education that Hacken provides. Again the biggest thing that I would always emphasize to people is if you want to be better at cybersecurity, you need to understand not only the basics, but a lot of the in-depth knowledge. And as you can see here, they have these very clean, colorful, and engaging modules that help you learn about not only the basics, but a lot of the complexities as well of cybersecurity. So for example, one of the things that I want to dive into here is the strong password uh, section of the modules. This is something that I, again, always emphasize. It's one of the key elements that a lot of people mess up on. And they have a really cool tool here where you can actually type in a password and see how long generally it would take for a hacker to crack that password to an account. So for example, if I type something like hello worlds, for example, something that's up to 10 characters, it could be cracked in less than 10 seconds. But if we start to see, you know, if we go back here for a second, we start to type a random conjunction of letters and numbers with different characters, we start to see that this password wouldn't be broke for centuries. And this is a very key practice that they teach here. One of the first key lessons as you go through, they teach you not to use things like password, very key obvious terms that hackers will look out for, or certain numeric increments of one, two, or three, followed by one another in this case. So again, a lot of interesting lessons that you can use uh, that really help you in the sense of taking on a, self, a sense of self-control here in the sense of your privacy, your passwords, and your data in this case, especially if you're managing financial information or things related to your finances that could be hacked or stolen. So again, highly recommend you guys go through the education modules, but along with that as well, they have the toolbox here, and this is the third item on the uh, tab at the bottom of the app. And this basically allows you to engage with a wide range of tools and services that Hacken provides. Now at the moment, there are two that are available. There's passwords and the darknet monitoring. And down here as well, we can see that they've got things that we talked about earlier, such as secure storage, multi-factor authentication, and also VPN technology. But again, this will come in due time. So the first two tools here they have here is the password manager. Now as you'll see here, I haven't imported any passwords into the application. Now sadly for the sake of this review, I actually won't be able to use the QR code scan feature as my phone recording software doesn't allow me to access my camera when I'm recording. But just to show you guys what it looks like, Hacken provides you with an EXE download in this case that allows you to instantly connect with either a wide range of browsers from Safari, Chrome, Opera, and Firefox to also platforms, for example, like LastPass and Dashlane. So you can connect to your already existing password managers or your browser applications where you might have some of your passwords saved. Again, Hacking is providing you the opportunity to have a password manager built into the application in this case. And basically, by clicking on one of these, for example, if we did, for example, Firefox, we click Import Passwords, our list of passwords would be here from the browser, and it would generate a QR code for us to scan in this case in order to access that information and import them into the application. But again, this is one of the many features they have on here. They also have darknet monitoring. So in this case, what I've done is I've actually plugged in my email here. This is our business email, for example, for the channel. And I've actually enabled uh, dark uh, darknet monitoring in this case, where what basically Hacken is going to do is they're going to keep a lookout in a lot of different darknet platforms to see if account information for our email or for our other platforms that we'll attach into the Hacken app have been compromised to some degree. If someone, for example, might have sold or captured our password information and sold it on the darknet, we'll be able to hopefully spot it here on the application and then for make changes to our passwords or our logins in this case. So a lot of really cool tools here on the app. Again, not overwhelming. The user experience is really clean and it's easy for anyone to pick up and it really makes cybersecurity simple for the average everyday person. Now along with that as well, one simple feature just to kind of throw out there as well is that in the application here, you actually can store a decent range of cryptocurrencies, mainly around the VeChain ecosystem. So you have VeChain, VThor token, and you can also store the Hacken AI tokens in this case. 
but we can see here as well that we have digital collectibles. So as you go throughout the educational modules, you'll actually be able to get collectible items for your high character. In this case, high is the little module, uh, little, little character here that they have here for uh, the module program within the Hack and App. You can see here that I earned a baseball cap. This is one of the lower tier NFTs that you can get for your, uh, your character in this case. And there we go, I've just customized my little high character here. So again, really interesting stuff here. I think the, the introduction of NFTs in this case, along with just providing basic wallet technology within the Hacken app is really cool here. And I hope over time they provide support for more cryptocurrencies, as I think it would be awesome to just again tie in your cryptocurrency experience with a cybersecurity app like this. I think it's a great idea. It really fits into the all-in-one uh, kind of approach that Hacken's going for. And along with that as well, there's different achievements here that you can unlock. So again, the gamification is real when it comes to hack, and there's a lot of things you can do. And there's also a settings tab in this case where you can use face ID or touch ID, so you don't have to type your password every time you open up the application. You can see your seed phrase in this case, which of course I will not show in this video. But along with that as well, you can migrate passwords and do all kinds of stuff here. So all in all here, right, to summarize the Hacken app, I can't wait to see a lot of the up-to-date features, for example, such as the VPN, multi-factor authentication. There's a lot of things that I'm looking forward to, but right now in its beta, the Hacken app is looking extremely impressive. And for those of you who wanna get your hands on it to test it out, it's available for iOS and Android in its beta currently. Now again, bear in mind it is in its beta, but at the same time, you can test it out, you can download it real time, start engaging in the educational material, and as features come along, test out what Hacken offers offers in this case. You know, one of the things that I really want to get across here as we close out the video is to bear in mind that in today's world, here today, cybersecurity has never been more relevant in our lives. It's not only played a massive role in the 21st century as one of the biggest issues that we've had to face as a general populace, but along with that as well with COVID-19, we have a lot of issues stemming from this viral outbreak. A lot of people working from home with a lot of their information susceptible to hackers and people who might compromise that information, as well as having to deal with a general influx in hackers and criminal activity as we enter into economic downturns. So I would really emphasize that all of you out there test out the beta version of the Hacken app, get more knowledgeable about cybersecurity, get a feel for some of the good general practices that you would want to take in this case in order to manage your data properly. But along with that as well, test out some of the cool tools that Hacken offers. I think it's a great application. The user experience is clean. And I really want to say hats off to the team for building such a quality mobile application. So again, for those of you who want to figure out more, definitely go test it out on iOS or Android. It's available on either App Store. And along with that as well, test out some of the features. Let me know your feedback down below in the comments. And you can check out the link in the description to find more information on their website. That being said, everyone, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Stay tuned.